It's about 10, 15 right now, and I'm headed to the gym. One thing about me is I never back down from a challenge. And what happened was I was challenged to a game of basketball, one-on-one. -on -one, so I'm about to go to this court and hand somebody out. Just to give you guys a little bit more insight on what happened, here's the backstory. So Destroying and I played one-on-one -on -one at the Nike headquarters last week. Ah! <laughs> Defensive player of the year, man. It's Stop not playing with me. And I decided to share a clip of it on my Instagram. Now, under the Instagram post, I said, like this comment if you think you can beat me one-on-one -on -one, and comment with the score. Well, a reality TV show star decided to comment and say that he can beat me. You're smoking crack. Stop. So I was like, all right, bro, like, I know you're not built like that, so we're going we gonna to play for real. Pick the location, and uh, we're going to make it happen. So that's what happened. Now, just so y'all know, I'm not a hooper. Like, I haven't played organized basketball since I was 15. But the thing is, I know I can beat people, and I got that Mamba mentality. Like, you're not about to just try to call me out and think I'm going to back down. I'm about to come and give you this L. Like, so pretty much, I play with the same mentality. If you let me beat you, you're trash. Like, you can't claim anything else. You can't claim, oh no, it was just an off game. No, you're trash. So uh, stay tuned. I'm gonna see you at the gym. All that shit you talking got nothing to do with me. Nah, I'm looking at my bare wrist. I need me. Let's get it. Well, bust down, bust down. Infinity stones like Thanos is glove now. I got a bad chick telling me to hit a line with a nigga finna touch down. Yeah, I'm back again with a new attitude and a lack of friends. I only have brothers. All them other niggas, I won't even come and dap your hand. And now a dance team. This is my manager slash brother, Platinum J. We here to take it over, man. Yo, what <laughs> up? Storage on this three, yo, <laughs> on this game. <laughs> Come on now, dog. Come on, man. Is that game? Get, him out of here. Get this, run this motherfucker off the floor, bro. <laughs> I don't even hoop. Talk to him. How, how you feel after that? Hey, video? look, man. I don't even hoop. I make videos you... for a living. Okay. First off, he be out here every day. I, first off, look, 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 I'm on a five day pass. Tell, I'm not even in tell, here. First off, yeah, yeah, but I'm the rep here. Yeah, to sign up. That was trash. I've been I've been hooping since eight o'clock this morning. Right, I've been hooping since was, eight o'clock. First of all, you was late. That's number one. You first off, first of all, you was late. You won't do it again, though. You won't put me again. Yo, tell tell us how how you got that win today. Hey, look, what happened was, yeah. first of all, I stepped on the court with a scrub. So I was like, yeah, oh, yeah. that's automatic W. Yeah. You know, I started to blow a lead a little bit. It was 5-1, but I was right. like, you know what? I'm going to let him you come back so it look good for camera. Right. right. So, so you let him win. What you, what, what's your take on that, yo, Flat? What's your take on that? It was trash. You know, if he didn't beat me, I beat me. You okay. feel me? I beat me. You know yeah. what? It was, I was, taking poor, I was taking poor <laughs> shots, you know? Okay, okay. The ball was a little, not my shade of color, yeah, you yeah, know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, the yeah, I mean, I'm just saying, I'm not racist good at basketball, but like, I was hooping with a lighter color. Yeah, you feel know me? Okay. Uh, he put it this. Sound, it sounded like, sound like we got a lot of excuses. Look, he, he put this bad t shirt on thinking it was going to give him motivation. It just made him nah, play bad. It made nah, nah. <laughs> it made nah man, listen, listen, nah. 
That was I play trash. I play yeah. trash. He's trash. You should run up to him. He's trash. But he's but trash. He but, but, he but, but, but yeah, I give it to and him. He's not he even can, a hooper. I'm but he can, he can have that. He can he have that. He's not even a member, though. I can have that. I'm not a hooper or a member. Come on, man. Right. He can have that. But you won't play me again. What did I tell you I was going to do? What did I tell you I was going to do? Look, I ain't even going to talk trash, bro. Look, I told you I was going to come up on that court and get that W. And I did what I said I was going to do. And keep in mind, I'm not a hooper. My man, be he be doing the hooping leagues and all that. I ain't doing all that. I make videos for a living, bro. I stepped on the court, and I did what I did. And that wasn't even my home court. That was his home court. Come on, now protect your house. You from Baltimore. You supposed to, you supposed to protect your house. Under Armour was made here. You ain't do that. See, if that was my court, I'd have held it down. But you ain't do that. Come on, Platinum. But everybody, show my man Platinum some love. But outside of that, man, there's a few things that I learned about hooping today. Number one. My ass gotta get back in shape, son. I, we was playing half court and I felt like I just finished running a marathon. Number two, my ass gotta stop blowing layups, bro. That joint really pisses me off because I feel like those are the shots I'm supposed to make, especially since I played power four when I was younger. So it's like, I should know how to work in the paint and all that other stuff. But you know, I'm getting washed up, getting older, I ain't getting younger, you know, knees getting worse. But it's like, no excuse, man. I got to make those damn layups. Jump shots, I don't really care that much because I've never really been a shooter. But them layups, that's where I'm supposed to really put my work in. Number three, I didn't even bother taking my head off. Y'all know when I take that head off, that's me bringing out my inner Jordan. So the fact that I didn't take my head off, that says more about his game than it says about mine. You feel me? And number four, I got to close out these games much sooner. That's why I was so damn tired because that game was so damn long. I had at least like a three or four point lead and I allowed him to come back. But it's like, you can't do that because once you let that person come back, if they hot enough, they going to shoot you out that game. So I got to be much smarter next time. I got to definitely finish the game when I had the opportunity to. Now, granted, I was tired as hell. Like I said, I felt like I was running a marathon, so I was really trying to catch my breath on some of those possessions, but ain't no excuse, man. Gotta get it done. But yeah, man, I appreciate you guys taking the time to watch this vlog. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Um, if you guys like these one-on-one -on -one videos or vlogs, I should say, just let me know, man. I'll definitely try to make this a thing play different people in one-on-one. -on -one. Just make sure you tell your favorite YouTuber or influencer to holla at me because, you know, I'm coming for that W. Look, most of y'all don't know this, but my first name is Wendell. My parents ain't named me Wendell for no reason. All I do is win. Word to DJ Khaled. So, like I said, man, Mamba mentality, you know. They call me DKG. The KG stands for Kevin Garnett, you feel me? Come on, man. I'm ready. I'm coming for these W's. So just let me know. Till next time. It's only entertainment.